get Sandra from Asexualized, My Asexual Life. This is a place to be for education about asexuality, all things asexual. And I share my own asexual life journey in order to help you in yours. If you haven't already subscribed, please hit that great big subscribe button right here, right now. Please hit that bell icon so you get notified of every time I post a new video. So, uh, yes, if you didn't know, this is Pride Month now that we're in June 2021. Uh, asexuality is part of the A in the acronym LGBT plus QIA and you might have heard me mention the word I yesterday and that means intersex so if you haven't heard of what intersex is an intersex person is someone who is born with both male and female genitalia now what's difficult for intersex people is obviously finding other people like themselves, but there are groups for intersex people. Um, you know, if they're looking to date or get into a relationship, and obviously having two lots of different parts of genitalia um, can make things difficult in terms of sexual relationships and relationships in general where physical contact especially is concerned. Also, um, there can be difficulties for intersex people um, because when they're born, their parents can decide for them um, without them knowing about it, basically, because they're too young to know which um, which gender they should be assigned to. So in other words, instead of leaving it until they're older, some parents decide to have their genitalia basically operated on, and then they want to choose the gender of the kids the baby themselves you know and so this is really really difficult um because you know you should be able to choose as you get older really because obviously if a person for example had both male and female genitalia and they had an operation as a kid to remove the female part of the genitalia then they were left with the male genitalia because their parents decided they should be male um in gender then you know if they if they feel like they're female later on or indeed neutral gender and they kind of want a part of them back they can't get that back you know so it's very very difficult um it's not easy for them at all you know there's there's quite a lot of um stories about how intersex people have had mutilations down there and all that type of thing um also how they're treated as well you know like someone to look down their underwear and stuff and and gawk at that type of thing and there's a lot of disgusting stuff that goes on that isn't fair to intersex people you know and i i came across an indian person who was actually and is actually intersex they were in the asexual community and they do a lot of representation for intersex people and they were describing in an article an indian article about the fact of you know how they were treated when people want to you know like professional people wanted to like you know look down there and and it's just disgusting and horrible and no one has the right to do that to someone's body and you know so for intersex people they can have physical complications and difficulties and it can also affect their mental health as well um for the reasons i've just mentioned so please especially as part of pride month but going forward from now onwards please have a lot of love and respect for people that have both female and genit female and male genitalia they cannot help it um it, you know it's who they are it's how they were born and if they want to change it later themselves then that's up to them that should be their own personal preference and choice it shouldn't be that someone's doing that for them and you know people shouldn't be using them as a as something to gawk or stare at you know they're beautiful wonderful people in and of their own right just like everyone else is all right so i hope that's been useful helpful and insightful for you if it has please give it a thumbs up please share this video with anyone who you think may need to hear this and benefit from it don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and hit that great big bell icon so you get notified of every time i post a new video lots of beauty lots of love to you i'll see you soon bye